guys, today I'm going to show you how to use artificial intelligence in M-Block. This artificial intelligence can, as you can see, recognize speech, recognize age, and recognize emotion. And it can also recognize text as well. So, to get it, just press the plus and download the AI service at the bottom right. And then click on it and you'll get AI. So if you're in the devices section, this will not show up. So remember you're on the sprites tab and then choose AI. So this can recognize speech. For example, if I recognize speech in English and show the speech recognition result, then I click on this. As you can see, it'll show the speech that you just said. So that, uh, as you can see, this black screen is actually where the webcam is supposed to be. So you can see my speech is still working like that. So you can do lots of different things with this. For example, if I go into this panda and then I do when green flag is clicked, say, say something. And then go to AI and recognize speech in Chinese for, I mean in English for 12 seconds. Then once it's done, uh, we're going to wait three seconds. Then ask and say, did you say? And then put the speech recognition result in there. So now let's test this out. So let's hide the speech recognition result here and start it. Hello. Did you say hello? and then you can just continue to do that so as you can see this is how you can use AI in mBlock it's going to be very useful when you're trying to make some kind of interface in which the user is going to interact with the program and things like that so it's a very useful piece of information and you can use it in a lot of your code I'm going to see in places where I can use them then maybe that might be a bit helpful to you but otherwise that's pretty much it you can also see you know different things like age recognition and emotion recognition so you use the webcam for that so yeah that's it thanks for watching this video hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe thanks for watching